Can Casper potentially reach the price of $3 during the next bull run? I think so, and let me explain why. First of all, I believe that Casper, in terms of fundamentals, is absolutely amazing. Casper is an enterprise-optimized layer one blockchain that allows for upgradable smart contracts and NFTs. And something that I find very special about Casper is that Casper actually has been able to solve the blockchain trilemma. And some people may be wondering, what is the blockchain trilemma? The blockchain trilemma is being able to solve decentralization, security, and scalability all at the same time, and Casper has been able to achieve just that. And I think that right there is very impressive. However, the same thing can't be said about Ethereum. Ethereum, as of right now, has not been able to solve the blockchain trilemma. You know, a lot of people, they say, oh wow, Ethereum's so amazing, Ethereum 2.0, it's the best. A lot of people like to say that, but I think people often neglect the fact that even with Ethereum 2.0, Ethereum still is not scalable. Yeah, it's proof of stake, but again, right, it isn't scalable. You know, Casper may be consumed considerably smaller than Ethereum right now, but I think in terms of fundamentals, I just believe it's more complete. The way I view it is that Casper is quite essentially Ethereum 3.0 because not only is it proof of stake, but it also is scalable. When people ask me what do I prefer, Casper or Ethereum, I am hands down choosing Casper 10 times out of 10. I just believe that as a layer one blockchain, I think Casper is better. And with all that being said, when it comes to Casper, a lot of the Casper haters out there, they like to say, oh man, who cares if Casper is focused on enterprise adoption? Oh, where's the potential in that? A lot of these Casper haters, they like to spew out this type of nonsense. You know, a lot of Casper haters, they may think this way. However, I don't think that way because I believe that enterprise adoption is the way to go moving forward, and I'll show you why I think so. For example, if we take a look at this, we will see that the global blockchain technology market is projected to grow at a compound annual growth rate of 85.9% reaching more than $1.4 trillion by 2030. And that right there is very shocking. However, what I think is even more shocking is the fact that 94% of Fortune 500 executives have already begun planning blockchain initiatives. And wow, I think that is a very mind-blowing statistic. But it doesn't end there because 89% of Fortune 500 executives believe that the next 10 years of Web3 innovation will define the next 100 years of business. And last but not least, 75% of global executives fear a loss of competitive advantage if they do not adopt blockchain technology. And this right here are all very staggering statistics. However, keep in mind, all of this growth is going to be largely driven by enterprise adoption. You know, a lot of layer one blockchains out there, they are focused on the retail market. And as a result, you know, they get a lot of hype, they get a lot of fans, and they can have incredible bull runs. But I think in the long term, I think enterprise optimized layer one blockchains like Casper will be the ones to reign supreme. Because when you think about it, enterprises, they have the most capital, they have the most resources, and they have the ability to promote growth at a much larger scale. I think Casper is doing the right thing by being focused on enterprises. And by the way, something that I find people often overlook about Casper is the fact that Casper actually has their very own enterprise grade NFT standard called CEP78. And some people may be wondering, oh, what makes CEP78 so special? And what makes it so special is the fact that NFTs are able to be upgraded and customized after they have been deployed. And this right here is extremely revolutionary because most NFTs nowadays lack the ability to be upgraded and customized after they have been deployed. And this right here is hindering NFTs from being adopted on a large scale. However, with CEP78, these issues are gone. Casper has quite essentially found a solution for NFTs to be adopted at a large scale. I think what Casper has achieved with CEP78 is extremely revolutionary. And here's the thing, when it comes to NFTs, you know, a lot of people, they may often overlook NFTs as of right now. They may see, you know, NFTs going down. They're like, oh man, where's the future in NFTs? And yeah, right, NFTs, they're not doing that hot right now. But I think in the future, that is not going to be the case because I think NFTs, will make a massive resurgence, and the data shows it. According to Grandview Research, the NFT market is projected to be worth over $211 billion by 2030. And I think that right there is very mind-boggling. I personally believe that the best is yet to come for NFTs. I think Casper is doing such a genius move by being focused on NFTs right here, right now. I think it's going to do wonders for them in the future. And now, when it comes to Casper at the price of $3, a lot of people, they may think, oh, that's too crazy of a goal for Casper. Oh, that's too outlandish. But in my opinion, I think that $3 for Casper, especially during the next bull run, I think is actually a very 
feasible target. And the reason why I think so is because if we take a look at Casper at the price of $3, Casper at that point would only have a market cap of around $32 billion. And $32 billion, that may seem like a lot, but in the world of cryptos, in the grand scheme of things, it's actually not that much. Because if we take a look at it, right, $32 billion is actually still over 50 billion less than what Dogecoin reached at its peak back in 2021 in terms of market cap. And that is not a joke right there. In 2021, Dogecoin had an all-time high market cap of over $88 billion. So I don't think Casper reaching the price of $3 is that unrealistic. And now if Casper needed you know, a $700 billion market cap, if it would need a $1 trillion market cap to reach the price of $3, then yeah, I get it, right? That would seem unrealistic, that would seem outlandish, but I think a $32 billion market cap is not that crazy in my opinion. We have seen a lot of other cryptos out there with far less fundamentals than Casper, with a use case that's far worse than Casper, reach much higher than that and beyond. So I think during the next bull run, we could very well see Casper at the price of $3, especially when I consider Casper's fundamentals, use case, and the industry that it's focused on. And now this is not a invitation to buy, sell, or trade Casper. That is not the case whatsoever. I am not a financial advisor, but I will say that I am extremely bullish on the future of Casper. And I think that during the next bull run, Casper is going to shock a lot of people. And by the way, I want to give a massive shout out to Report Events and Fabrice. I greatly appreciate the continued support. Thank you so much. During the next bull run, we're all going to a totally different dimension. Fabrice and Report Events will see each other at the top. And if you want to check out a very interesting video, make sure to go ahead and click on this thumbnail right here. It's a very fantastic video and I think you all would really love it. It's a very wonderful video.